Hey, Pablo Gunner here for a nerdy fitness vlog. It feels like it's been a really long time, which maybe it has. And so here's the deal. I was uh, I was sick for a little bit, and I also went on a trip to Pagosa Springs. Uh, the wife and I had a little getaway, and it was really, really interesting because I did not work out the whole time, and I actually felt like I looked really good. Like, obviously, I wasn't getting more defined or, or you know, bigger, more muscular or anything like that. But I was just, I wouldn't eat. We wouldn't eat unless we, we wouldn't go out to eat unless we were hungry. And so it was this great thing that worked because we also, we split every, almost everything except for one meal that ended up as leftovers. Because it was huge portions, very expensive huge portions very good too but so yeah it, it was nice because we shared everything the wife and I and so it ended up being the perfect amount and we even had like we had a lot of bad stuff like we had a lot of uh ice cream well it wasn't like big things ice cream we got like the super mini ice creams and that's what we had for like watching movies but even then, like, it was, like, as dessert, you know, after we ate. And it was, we didn't eat it just to eat it. We ate, like I said, if we were hungry. So, like I said, I felt like I looked really good checking myself out in the mirror as I do uh, throughout the trip and stuff. So, yeah, so it just, it went to prove and it go, went to show, hey, I don't have to work out as long as I eat right for the most part. So, you know, proven right there. So, uh, but anyways, I wanted to do, last night I came into work early to work out. And I did my, you know, my, my X training, which is the yoga and the, um, and then the mostly like upper body cardio stuff. But also some lower body, but mostly. And so... I wanted to do legs in the morning when I got up, but unfortunately, I had some training to do that written it, it, would, it required taking a test, or a couple tests, and they took a couple hours, so, and, um, and I got off, like, almost, uh, with, like, about an hour of, of OT, that's on average, so, that's not out of the norm, um, and it, I, it was really nice. It was really nice how things worked out. I called this person. I said, hey, can I get relieved early? I have this test to go take. They're like, hey, I'll do my best, you know. Boom. The guy, one of the guys was like, hey, well, I'm the, you know, your relief is not, but I'm his relief, so I'll go relieve him. I just need a ride. Can you give me a ride? Gave him a ride. His, you know, my relief came out. Boom. It just worked out so smoothly and so nicely, and it's like, this is how it should work. Like a well-oiled machine. Everybody does what they're supposed to you know, it was fantastic. Good communication. Everything worked out. You know, that's, that's, I, I love that. I love that stuff. So anyways, like I said, it took me a while to do the test though. So I didn't get out until I get off. Cause technically the, the schedule is from like 11 to seven. But like I said, we usually get at least an hour of OT. So it ends up being eight on norm. But like I said, I didn't get off until 11 because of the tests so uh so yeah I did that and it was it was it, you know it was fine um but the biggest problem was that I didn't eat during my like I did eat but this is what happened okay so I wasn't really hungry for my workout which I destroyed I, I was just like fantastic I know it's yoga but like the rest of it I've totally you know destroyed it it was awesome so felt good felt fantastic but I wasn't hungry so I didn't eat and so it worked out really well I didn't I, you know and then I had I gave this guy a break an hour break and I was like okay I'll warm up my food the wife made me a couple pieces of salmon and green beans so that's what I ate is these small pieces of salmon and some green beans and it hit the spot it was great and then I was like, oh, I'm hungry, but I don't know how long it's going to take me to do this test. I thought maybe it was just an hour. And so wasn't the case. It took me a couple hours. So I, that's, that's how it goes sometimes. And 
So I was like, man, I'm so starving. I did have uh, nectarine while I was there testing, but like even that, like by the time I got off, I was still starving. So I was like, I do not have the energy to do a hardcore legs workout right now. So I was like, forget it. I'm, I'm going home. Besides, and I was gonna, I was supposed to go get comics today too, from Twin Sons. And and age of comics if I had time, but at least twins. And I couldn't because I just got off. Well, I, I bullshitted with the you know one of my buddies from from my class uh, at my work class, like that we did training together and stuff. So yeah, and, and so I ended up being like it was like a solid thirty minutes we were talking. So I didn't I I'm just about to get home now and it's almost one which is late for me so i'm gonna go home i'm gonna upload the video for the assassin's creed freedom cry and then i'm going to sleep so i'll throw so i'm throwing that up there uh comic cast is up for 200 or for 299 but i'm wondering what should i actually this video will probably come out after we do comic cast 300 but i'm curious still what we should do for comic cast 300 should we like of course i'm gonna give away all kinds of digital comics but i feel like i, I want to give away comics for something not just i mean i'll probably give random comics away but how about for each question a person asks you get a comic or i'll, I'll give away a comic i mean i'll give a comic to the person that asks it but I'll also give away random comics so it's not just you know people can show up just randomly and people don't have to ask questions but people who ask questions will get more comics get more free digital comics uh but what other kind of stuff should we do for our 300th comic book podcast i tried to get a, uh, I tried to get a uh, scat schneider to to do a little sound bite or or do a phone in but he's too busy with metal now so can't i don't blame him you know i don't blame him hey you know you're a big deal i'm not i'm nobody you know and not only that like you're busy working on on all these comics so and uh yeah so anyways so yeah um that's it so uh stay nerdy my friends oh yeah stay fit stay healthy love and peace